Hello there folks and welcome to my May favorite. So today for you I have three new makeup favorites, two skincare, two random favorites, um, one movie, four mini makeup and so on. So let's get started. First off I am going to start with my makeup. The makeup I have been loving are these three parts. Two are from cover up and one is made. Uh, let's start with makeup first. Um, this one is the Mainly Instant Rewind Concealer. I love it because it helps me with my dark circle and any um, brightness I have that my foundation does not cover. Uh, I usually use I usually use my Mainly Fit Me Concealer first, and then powder, and then use it over the powder, and then powder again, just because I like to use it. So yeah, but it helps me get a little bit of a time. When I have a little extra time <laughs> on my hands, it's I'm just in a rush. And speaking of in a rush, being in a rush. When I am in a rush, I use my CoverGirl Atlas Face Iris 3 Month Condition. It is a primer, concealer, and a foundation one. I love this because it really does cover all my spots and my imperfections that I don't want to show out to the world. Like, oh, I don't want to scare you. Or anything, but it helps me a lot. Like, um, plus it's, very, it's a very like, setting and it blends in very well. Like, it's easy to blend. Like, I just like mix the blend. I don't want to use brush. Like, part of me use brush to my fingers on the foundation. Like, the only thing I use for brushes are eyeshadow and um, highlighter. <laughs> oh, and blush. <laughs> oh, and bronzer. So I show a bronzer, blush, and highlighter. Four things that I usually pull to the brushes for all of the days. Um, oh, and powder. Speaking of powder, oh, you know, just put it up, oh, like that. <laughs> it's, it's the CoverGirl Ready to like, Gorgeous Powder. I, this this letter is caught to me when I, first, when I saw it in the store. It's like a magenta, like shimmer thing. And then we open it, this is what it looks like. I got it in there and the sponge <laughs> on the bottom. Um, I did use the sponge for the first trial just to try it like I used. Like I tried this and then I put the powder over it just to see how it just like it matched each other. After this came out so fast. <laughs> on to skincare. The skincare are these two lines. One is a face wash and one is a white. Um the face wash I use um a night. Right before I go to that is the Garnier Clean Black, um, Blackhead Eliminating Scrub. I, it has charcoal in it and it is oily skin. They have other ones that have like a combination skin and a dry skin one, but I do the oily skin. I think, more, I think this works better on me than the like, combination. I tried combination and I really like it, so I use the oily skin, which helps me um, get rid of my acne. Um, I have, I usually get acne on my chin, around my nose, and my cheeks. I don't really get my forehead anymore. I used to get it like, all over when I was like in high school. So yeah, but that's really how I toned down my um, acne. It's a really good gel, like the exfoliator, so it is healthy to explore. I don't use it every day. I just use it when I need a little extra, like, um, Look, extra help with some things. I also use the um I use the clean clear um face wash, which is just like it's not like a it's not a scrub. It's just like a gel that helps like a, a, a gel treatment. So I use that um every other day that I don't use that. So yeah, before I go to bed and when I wake up, I use the simple. Or it needs facial life. I love this because it helps waken up my skin. Um, and I've heard people like uh, talk about this before. Why uh, I would try it out, and I have, and I fell in love with it. Before I used this, I used to use the Elf um, makeup wipes. I still use them when I have like a little extra like help and help when I'm not in the shower trying to wipe it up. 
Um, so, but I usually just go to bed when I wake up and really look at my skin and help um, me set my moisturizer and my primer before I do my foundation. So, I like that. And then, so I have makeup and skincare. Let's do my brand. So, I'm going to do the my brand as well. So, I would do the movie I've been loving that I've been watching all of May. Well, mostly May. Okay. I feel like in the middle of May watching this and I just watch it a lot. It is the movie Epic. If you guys have seen this, you will know what you want to say or do this. So, yes, clearly. Um, she is only for like at the beginning of the part, but I still like it. Um, let's see what I got. It's about a teenager, um, recruited by nature, um, to help Quintana for his fiance. Um, to help policemen save their existence and from um, the evil warriors, which are like, trying to kill the forest. There's another movie that's like this, and it's made like in the 90s. I think it's called This Just a Small People, you know. If you've seen it, let me know what it is, because I really don't want to watch that. I'm trying to find out the name. I think it's I'm pretty sure it says it's an S. Forget <laughs> what it is. So next, let's do music. The music selection I have been loving is I have two songs that I have been loving. It is her. Let me explain it and see if people will guess it. So go wait. Black Magic by Little Mix. I love this song. It just helps me set, be in such a good mood. Like it's a very like, pumped up like um sound. So if you, every time like you as well pick me up and I was listening to this song. Plus I am set with Little Mix. Their style and like their makeup that they do. Love them. Love them stuff. Um and then the next song they're gonna play yeah, for a little bit of it. by Andy Grammer. Um, uh, I think he's amazing. I love, I love all his songs that he has done. Um, especially this one's my favorite. Like, I know that the big guy Gene knows him, but he's, like, chosen to be with his girlfriend or wife or whatever he's with. Um, uh, so, um, I don't really like that he's with the girl, but I love, like, the beat of the music, you know? Um, so yeah, I just, when I listen to songs, I tend to like find a good beat and I don't feel like listen to lyrics until like after a couple like quite songs and stuff that I don't to do, you know, that kind of thing. Um, next let's do random things. My two random things is a body wash and a candle. I know. <laughs> I love that. Um, the body wash I use is the, um, Canada. Fine fragrance. What is this song? Is it going to be a royal? I don't know. I don't know, but it's a, it's a, um, a dwarf star one. This one has to be my favorite out of the collection. I just smell so good. And it comes out pink. It's a pink. Like shade, and then it turns to like white. Oof, I'm not sure that. And then when you rub it on, it just. I don't see, like. I should do that. Like, if I don't have any perfume in it, I'll just get a little bit of that and just rub it, like, on my wrist. So I can get it throughout the day. It reminds me of, like, a licorice scent type. Like, a very sweet, but also, it's very strong. So, a little bit does go on my. And it says that it's a 12 hour fragrance, so I'm not sure if like, it lasts 12 hours, like, I don't think it does. I think it lasts me like, 5. <laughs> so, but it's good for like, 
like when you take in the morning shower and you just like or you know you're going out that night and you take a shower before so I love using that like that and then candle is from Aspen Body Works I agree with Louise that I do not really like the uh, packaging love the scent this one is um, warm vanilla sugar and I absolutely love it and that's the same vanilla so that has a nasty note or anything like like sweet like any of the vanilla sweet well, fruity scent will come to my face. I just, I just, I just so fun. I also have a um, peach scent from Bath and Body Bath and Body Works. I think I do. I think I try to do it. I'm not sure. I think I post like a picture on Twitter with them. So yeah. Uh, and then my my lastly my section of the series is um. Yeah. Um, my last thing is my favorite YouTuber. We have four. And four lovely ladies. Um, one is Brittany from Getting Pretty. Um, she does like she I think she's like sixteen or eighteen, I'm not sure. I think um, but I just watched her get ready to make picnic. Oh my god, I love it. Like, I want to, like, do her makeup and everything. And all of, like, her, like, videos are very, like, um, they're very bright. And they're very, like, they really make me happy and such. And then, um, another girl is Rachel Berry. I don't know if you guys know about her. I think she's, I don't want to say, I don't want to say, like, She's either British, English, I don't know, she's either British, American, or Australian. I'm not sure, because I think she has a slight accent, but I'm not sure where she's from. But anyway, she does makeup, and I love her makeup for her, because even though sometimes, like, oh my god, sometimes I like, oh, so much makeup, but in the end, oh my god, it's so pretty. I wish I could do that. I don't know, I just love her. Well, she has her makeup. Like, even though I think it's like a little too much for me, I, I just watched her, um, even like her simple routine is all so much. Like, I'm like, oh, that's simple. That's so, like, my school day makeup. I saw it so pretty. It was like, it was like a simple makeup, but like, oh gosh. And she has the prettiest lights. Like, they're kind of like the Zoe. The lights are just like, oh, oh my gosh, it's so pretty. And then, um, oh shit, I have five YouTubers. Oops, missed that one. Sorry. Um, it's Jackie Wire. She is a Canadian YouTuber. Um, my favorite video she did was her, the hair, she does makeup and hair tutorials. I love it. Um, um, she does this hair tutorial that had like three or four different styles. So it was like based off the movie Age of Island. I want to try the second one. It's like a twist here, twist the first part, and then like a bun thing, like a messy like ballerina bun in the back. I just want to wear that one day. Like, and then I want to do the um pretty base one. I think third. Third I should do that one. And then speaking of another Canadian YouTuber, it is um. Tara Mitchell, Michelle, or Michelle, I think it's Michelle, it's Tara Michelle, um, she just did a video, she just uploaded a video that was, um, DIY Star Rectory, okay, once you try to make my own Star Rectory, and you know, Star Rectory is quite pricey, and I hate, like, when I oh, I don't know what money, you know, I think I know, like, my own, like, clothes, or makeup, that would be so bad. <laughs> Saving my makeup and everything. Um, anyways, I really want to try to make my own um, berry hibiscus tea because that is my favorite drink. I love it. I think every time before I go to work, um, because I just start with straight right, right there where I work, um, so I like just walk to work and then put the Starbucks and then walk into work and then start working, you know. Um, yeah, so I really want to try, like, just lemonade. Like I just, first you do like one cup of 
slice the lemonade and have this sweet and then some grown berries in it. It's very simple. And I'm like, oh, it's pretty easy. I can do it myself instead of buying like Starbucks because it would probably be, I know the would probably be much easier to drink, so I wouldn't be spending less money. Maybe it's a little cheaper. You know, getting a lot of money you get, go to the cheapest side of this. And I'll probably buy the simple lemonade too. Uh, next is an Irish YouTuber. Um, I love her accent. Like Irish people, I just love their accents. I don't know why. Or Australian, or anybody with accents. But Irish has the most favorite accent. Like if I had to choose. Um, she did a Cinderella makeup. That's the newest Cinderella with Lily James in it. I got it. And she did like a day makeup and then a night version. Like she did. The day make was um, when um, Cinderella was in the forest, and then the night make was in the when she was the ball and she had that all like glittery uh, eyeshadow on and the it was so pretty. And it looks pretty like fresh, like the day make looks very fresh and very um, glowy, like very like and then she used like a peach, peach pinkish blush that he's really pretty. I think it'd be great for like a summer day thing. I think I'm going to try that. I'm going to try to play Comment down below um, saying that you want me to trade it and I will trade it. I got really great company. I got a tape. Lydia's spring makeup and then Tony Burnley thing and then spring baby glitter one and then now now I'm going to see Cinderella. So comment below on the 21 next. And uh, that's basically it for my May favorite. This is the fifth place I think this I probably ramble too much. But I like to be chatty. Like, I, I'm a very talkative person. <laughs> and again, so I'm getting sick. So, <laughs> yeah. It's one of those times where like, the season's changing and you don't get that used to one season. And, yeah. So it's not going to happen. Anyways, I'll see you all next time. I love you all. And thanks for watching. Bye!